Like and subscribe to my channel and click the bell icon to get new video updates. Stop ignoring Georgia, calls for expansion of Tier 1 inclusion in Georgia, after continued U-20 success ruck, following the continued success of the Georgia U-20 side, at the ongoing U-20 World Cups in 2023. Calls for Georgia to enter first-tier rugby competitions are growing louder. The Maroons sit comfortably at the top of Group C. After a hard-fought 33-23-1 defeat by South Africa saw Georgia secure a landslide victory over Argentina in Round 2 and beat Las Pumas 20-0, and most recently the Junior Lilos was a clear winner against Italy, securing with 1-30-16 success to advance to the group stage. The ongoing debate over Georgia's status as a second-tier rugby nation has left the East Europe senior team trapped under the glass ceiling of the European Rugby Championship, with Georgia the dominant force within the competition, which many rugby fans and pundits believe should be opened up. There is an ongoing debate over the need for an annual promotion and relegation playoff game against the bottom six nations. Ahead of the World Cup Georgia U-20s recorded a historic victory over England U-20s, ending a two-game streak in Polisi. Georgia U-20s secured a dramatic 40-38 win over England's next generation, a result that has once again reignited debate over Georgia's status as a Tier 1 rugby nation. Georgia's hopes of competing in Tier 1 rugby competitions have recently been hit hard. After confirming that the Six Nations teams in Sanzer will host a new biennial tournament, 